guys, my name is Aika and welcome to my channel. This is gonna be my last unboxing. <laughs> with this polka dot which I love so much I can't really wear it outside unless I wear some shorts or pants underneath uh, simply because it's transparent a little bit you can't see it on the camera but I can see it on the reflection in the mirror and everything is pretty much see-through especially on the light so this is all ugly this is like really ugly anyway so here is my look i'm using my dji osmo mobile 2 and yeah i'm just loving it today as promised i'm doing the part two of my unboxing video um, also, I must say that this is going to be my last unboxing. Okay, um, I don't want to say the last, but I'll just say that I think that for the moment I need to take a break from shopping because um, I was really focusing on how to impress you guys and everything by showing you so many different things, by buying a lot of stuff. Not sure that I actually need so I really want to take a break from shopping and try to focus on different things, maybe reviews or outfits of the week or some other kind of videos apart from the unboxings. I know they can be a little bit too much and I feel like um, I just bought too many things and I feel really bad about it. So <laughs> yes. Um, this will be the last unboxing for the moment. This is everything I wanted to say before I begin. So now let's get right into unboxing this little babies that I have around me. I am super, super excited. So as this is a part two of my unboxing video, I will just tell you a little story behind. So we went on a trip. We stayed in Italy in the little village called Bordighera if any of you know it. So we stayed there but we kept traveling around Italy and France so everything that I want to show you was bought in Nice and Monaco. So yeah, that's uh, basically the story behind all the items. Oh, but one item from Gucci was actually bought in Riga. We stayed there overnight and um, there is like an outlet store which my family really really loves because they have all the sizes and they have such a big variety of different clothes and shoes and yeah pretty much everything so I was so excited when I saw these babies and I think you're gonna love them and the price was so good I just couldn't believe my eyes I couldn't believe that they were actually selling these shoes on such a big discount and apart from the store discount that they uh, had they actually give additional discounts to their loyal customers and my dad knew that and he was like oh you know we actually come here quite a lot so maybe we can get an extra discount and we got like a hundred euros more of them uh, but I'll show you everything in a bit. I'll start off by showing you this black box from Dior and from the shape, from the color and everything. You know this is a pair of shades. I bought this very last minute because 
I passed by the store, I saw them and it was love from the first sight. So yeah, I just got them. They are so gorgeous. Look at them. They look so nice. I used to have the same uh, pair of shades before, but the size was smaller and they just looked small on my face because I have a round shape if I put my hair back, which I'm not doing today. Uh, but yeah, I love this ones especially because you can see the print of Jadior in gold all around them. I'm not sure if you can see it on the camera, but it is definitely there and it is super pretty. I'm going to take a separate shot of how they look. They are just a piece of treasure and I love them. I wanted to get a simple pair of black shades and um, I really love the gold touch in them. I love the golden print of Jadio. It is very feminine, it is very modern, it is very on trend and they suit me well. So this is the number uh, one purchase that I wanted to show you. So moving on to my next item, I guess it will be from... Okay, Gucci. Let's open this big box. I have to say that I already wore the shoes on a date with my fiance back in Italy. Uh, because I was super excited about them and I really wanted to wear them with the outfit. I picked up, here was the box. I'll open it quickly so I can finally show you what I got. <laughs> so here they are, my Gucci loafers. I don't know how you call them, pumps, heels. Um, I have to double check on the website. Okay guys, I found them. So they're called leather meat heel loafers. They look so pretty and so stunning. I actually never really liked this kind of heels that just wasn't my style. You have this amazing, pretty pearls around and studs and this Gigi sign over here. It is also in this vintage gold color, which I absolutely love. Another pretty cool thing about them is, okay. <laughs> Did you just see that? Is this part at the back of the shoe, you can actually slide them in like this and you've got this sort of mule kind of vibe. I absolutely love them. Moving on to the third item now. Which one should it be? I think I'll start off with this one from Louis Vuitton. You know, I've been thinking lately that every time I show you something is not wrapped, so it kind of looks old or used. In some cases, yeah, I cannot wait to wear an item and I just do, and then I put it back to show you guys, but it's still new. But for the rest of the items, I don't know what's up with them in the, in the stores. When I buy things, they just never wrap them up. For a pair of sunglasses, that's all right, I understand. It's a pair of sunglasses, which I bought from a sunglasses store. Or the Gucci loafers, which I bought all right, I get it because I bought them from an outlet store and it is not Gucci and they wouldn't put a ribbon on. But when you buy from brands like Louis Vuitton, why the hell not to put a tiny little ribbon just to make it look a little bit nicer? Please. Uh, maybe I should ask them or maybe I should tell them it's a gift for someone. I don't know, I have to think about it, but it's quite annoying. I don't really mind. I didn't really mind when I bought them for myself just to please my soul. But when I'm showing this to you guys, I really want you to see the best out of the brand, the best of the packaging, the best of everything basically, um, the best experience you can get. And looking at this, you don't really get one. Oh, whatever. Are you ready? Are you ready? 
Here they are my new Louis Vuitton sneakers. I don't know the name of the model, I never ask. They look pretty simple, it is black leather, rubber sole underneath, which I like a lot because it won't get dirty, one, it won't get ruined, two. I love this canvas line, this little, yeah, detail, it looks nice. And I know this part is gonna protect my leather because these parts for me personally are very sensitive because I might walk and hit something accidentally. Um, I know not many accidents like this should happen to a person who is entering the adulthood, but it happens to me. And this part usually gets scratched the most. I also love this little detail right here. Um, this is like an opener. Imagine if you had to undo this laces every single day to put your shoes on and then to take them off it would have been such a pain in the ass thank god they made this little zip inside okay so this i believe is the rabbit fur i'm not sure but it feels nice though and inside there is more fur feels like the ox they are very warm and I think they are so good for winter times. They look simple, they look pretty plain, but I still love the little details. The next item I want to show you is from Chanel. And this is what I was talking about, guys. The ribbon. It looks so nice and pretty. The only thing that I'm missing now are the camellias, which are the best part of the packaging, but I did not guess they ran out. So here is the item. I wasn't planning on buying these particular shoes. I never really thought of them as something I wanted. When we came to Chanel, I remembered that I saw this pair on Sarah Denise's Instagram. I mention her again because I see a lot of things on her which I like. And I just accidentally remembered and I asked if they had a pair of these sneakers in black and gray. When he came back, he was like, you are so lucky we have your size and this is the only pair that we actually have in the store. Here are my new Chanel sneakers. This is nylon on top right here and uh, this is like a winter jacket material which is so fun to wear but I have to be careful not to rip this part off by accident. The rest is all skin suede around in black. There is a CC logo right here and there are CC logos all over the shoe at the back as well. Um, I love the color combination. I love the black, the gray and the white. This is the combination I really wanted to get and I was really lucky to find these gorgeous sneakers which I hope to wear a lot, especially now in fall. I know for the moment guys my past unboxing videos were a little bit boring because I just showed you what I bought but I didn't actually show how it looks on you. There is a reason for that. I didn't want to mix all of this together. I wanted to show you the items separately. I will be doing the mud shots, I will be doing the outfits of the week for example, I will be doing some review videos where I'll go in depth talking about each item separately. So just bear with me, be patient, I am planning to do everything I just mentioned. I'm moving to the last thing I want to show you. This item is very special for me because it was my dad who gifted this item to me. 
and it is very sentimental. He is something very special. He just wanted me to have something that will remind me of him, but basically everything reminds me of my parents, of my dad and my mom, because everything I have is thanks to them. I'll just stop talking again and I'll show you what we got with my dad for me. And the item we've picked up with my parents is in this little Cartier box. I am super duper excited about it. It means so much to me because it was a gift from my father. The Cartier love ring from the love collection in a thinner version there is a bigger one which i didn't quite like because i have quite thin fingers and it just looked too much also i have the matching bracelet in rose gold so i've decided to go uh, for the ring in rose gold to match my bracelet so now i have a full set i know there are also earrings and a necklace from the same love collection but i just feel like it will look too much and two pieces is already enough there is um, how the ring looks isn't it gorgeous i absolutely love it also the ring came with um, this box this is like a care pack I've got this lotion for jewelry and watches. It also comes with a little piece of cloth and a little brush. It looks like a cheap version of a toothbrush, the one you get at the airport. So guys, I guess this is it for my today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment and subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed to it yet and I'll see you in my next video very soon. Bye!